War isn't for anybody. It isn't for humanity, and even more so, it's not for women. On the 22nd of June, 1941, war came to Russia. Hitler's surprise attack results in the deaths of 150,000 Soviet soldiers and civilians in a single week. Luftwaffe bombers destroy most of the Soviet Air Force before its pilots can take to the skies. There's this poem that into a burning house she will come. This is the kind of women there are in Russia. And somebody wrote she would be happy to put on a pretty dress, but the horses keep running and running and the houses keep burning and burning. We went to the front. We really wanted to be there. We asked to be there. It was like a gift, a gift of fate. Конечно, летишь в ночь в огонь. Стреляют. You fly at night. You are flying into fire, and people are shooting at you. The searchlights are looking for you, and all of a sudden, the searchlights hold on one of our planes. The German fighters come at you. You see their rockets, red and green from the heat, and the searchlights keep holding on the burning plane. You want to scream for help, but you know that there is no help. That is a real meaning of fear. When Germany attacked, the Russian army was not ready for the war, but we women were volunteers. Every day we came to our government centers and asked them to take us. Finally, Stalin gave a permission to organize a women's aviation unit. I'd never seen a plane before the war at all. I really liked my plane. The Po-2 is a female plane because it was light, very easy to control. You'd shut down the gas and turn off the motor to glide silently over the target. We flew out five, six, even ten times a night so we were over them always until dawn. Anybody who shot down one of our planes, they got a special medal from Hitler. The Germans, they were very afraid of us. They called us the night witches. Dear mother, you cannot even imagine how happy I am. I flew into an air fight for the first time. I yelled very loudly. Hurra! It's good that my friends did not hear because they would have laughed at me. There's something about a woman's need to show herself stronger than the man, so they won't laugh at you. You wait all day to get your flight mission, and you have to fly where your friends have just burned up, and you don't want to. You are scared and you get ashamed of yourself. You think, I'm not better than them, am I? We were all very young, beautiful, happy. Girls were wounded, but they didn't leave. They had broken bones, but they stayed with their squadrons. Each time my soul flew out with the plane, our childhood was only there recently, but it seemed like it was very far away. And a long time ago.